To learn more about earning college credits with study hall courses, visit GoStudyHall.com or click the link in the description. What makes you, you? Well, a lot of things. Your perspectives, aspirations, talents, fears, signature dance moves, relationships with the people you love, maybe even your green thumb or a version of sesame seeds. But there are two things that are incredibly important to who you are, your mind and your behavior. Together, they encompass what you think, feel, and do. And while your mind and behavior can seem mysterious, there's actually a lot we know about them. Thanks to psychology, the scientific study of the mind and behavior. Over the years, psychologists have done many experiments, some that are really clever and some that, well, they shouldn't have done, if we're being honest. Through this work, they've discovered and continue to discover important patterns in the ways that we behave and think. Turns out we have a lot in common when it comes to how we respond to what's around us, how we learn, what happens when we feel emotions, who we admire, and much, much more. So that makes psychology a powerful way to understand human nature, one that's relevant to you personally and to all of us. Thanks to psychology, I know why hip hop makes me happy and how social media keeps us scrolling endlessly. Psychology Psychology gives us valuable insights on what it's like to be a person, and that can help us better relate to others with empathy and to ourselves with self-compassion. And psychology isn't just about explaining us to ourselves and getting along more harmoniously. It can also be about leaning into the mysterious, like take dreams. We've pondered them for millennia and studied them for decades, but psychologists still have different theories about what they are. One theory is that dreams can be like a form of therapy, a safe space for emotions to play out. Or you might prefer the theory that says dreams are just electrical pulses firing and they don't have deeper meaning. We're still figuring out what dreams really are. And wide open questions like this are part of what makes psychology so exciting. Like all science, psychology is an ever evolving realm of knowledge and possibilities. And I'll be your guide to the riches of this realm, taking you through fascinating and heady topics like motivation, stress, consciousness, intelligence, and personality. Hi. I'm Deja Fitzgerald, and welcome to Steady Hall, Intro to Psychology. I consider myself a bit of a tryhard, so I've never pursued my interests in a half-hearted fashion. I have a bachelor's degree in psychology and a master of education in student affairs. And since apparently I couldn't stand the idea of making a sizable income too early in my career, now I'm working on my doctorate in counseling psychology at the University of Tennessee. Throughout my educational career, I've also had various professional opportunities. Like I've had leadership roles with the American Psychological Association's Society of Counseling Psychology, and I've also been involved with the Recording Academy and the hip hop scene in the Pacific Northwest. Central to all of my work is the pursuit of well-being, sense of belonging, and intercultural development for minoritized and marginalized populations in a variety of settings. That includes intimate relationships, organizations, the music industry, and more. In my spare time, you can usually find me playing a video game, hanging out with one of my mini pets, or aggressively narrating shows on HGTV. Together, we'll go on a journey through topics ranging from the history of psychology to positive psychology, and see the myriad ways that psychology can help us know and wonder more about what makes us who we are. If you're enjoying Study Hall Intro to Psychology and are interested in taking an online course and earning college credit, go to GoStudyHall.com or click on this button to learn more. Thanks for watching. See you next time.